The Oscar De La Hoya vs. Floyd Mayweather Jr. fights were a defining chapter in the history of boxing. These two legendary fighters clashed in the ring twice, captivating the world with their contrasting styles and immense skill. The first bout took place on May 5, 2007, and was billed as The World Awaits. It was a highly anticipated showdown between the experienced and iconic De La Hoya, who had won titles in multiple weight divisions, and the undefeated rising star Mayweather. In the lead up to the fight, De La Hoya was viewed as the larger, more powerful fighter, while Mayweather was renowned for his speed, defense, and technical brilliance. The fight itself lived up to the hype, as both fighters showcased their strengths and engaged in an intense battle. De La Hoya was aggressive, throwing a high volume of punches and trying to overpower Mayweather. Meanwhile, Mayweather utilized his exceptional defensive skills, slipping and countering with precision punches. After a grueling 12 rounds the fight went to the judges' scorecards. In a closely contested decision, Mayweather emerged victorious, securing a split decision win over De La Hoya. While some felt that De La Hoya's aggression should have earned him the victory, others acknowledged Mayweather's effective boxing skills and overall ring generalship. The second fight between the two boxing icons didn't materialize until six years later. By then, Mayweather had solidified his place as one of the greatest pound-for-pound -pound fighters in history, while De La Hoya had retired from professional boxing. However, De La Hoya, tempted by a desire to avenge his previous loss, announced his comeback and set his sights on Mayweather. Unfortunately, negotiations between the two fell through, and the anticipated rematch never occurred. Nevertheless, the Oscar De La Hoya vs. Floyd Mayweather Jr. fights remain significant landmarks in boxing history, showcasing the clash of styles and personalities that captivate fans. These bouts exemplified the essence of the sport, pitting two exceptional fighters against each other and leaving a lasting impression on the boxing community. And that, he's had to back up and don't worry about eating the jab, I say. Just take it and go right at him. slick, though. His hands are so fast. His defense... Yeah, he's backing off. I've never seen this before. I mean, you think Floyd Mayweather have to react to the guy in front of him. seeing the fight totally. And, and this was that worst on him. Now, Shane also told me that I saw him beginning to do that. See, jab, jab, I haven't seen anybody really tag him. But this is a pretty good round for Oscar. Homework. He knows how he has to beat Floyd Mayweather. And he rounds two. Mayweather fading and posturing. Oscar will have no of it. None of it. As the bell in Mayweather winning the first round. And De La Hoya very close in the second round. And very close. When you're looking at the judges, are you going to be the guy that throws more hits? Usually. But remember that Oscar throws more. But Floyd lands by punches. He's very, very accurate. And out of the judge. And round three will be the perfect example of it when we look back. But that, it's it's a treat to have to see him do this. The golden boy up to surprise everybody in Cinco de Mayo. Who would lead to President Suleiman and his son Mauricio Suleiman. It's being cut off by De La Hoya. You'll see the left hook by Mayweather. Then Oscar De La Hoya is on him. Mayweather just smiles at him and takes a whack at him on the inside. Then he says... Mayweather seemed to be having fun with Oscar. Now he comes back. He him with that left hand. He sticks it out. Turned the momentum of the round around with Delahoy. Revit fight plan. That one wasn't blocked. And now, though, with. We'll... For Mayweather, it's about speed, elusiveness, and defense, and accuracy of the body. There wasn't a heck of a lot of difference. And at the bell, the left hook's here. Here, here he comes. Boom, Boom, one. And, you know, these actually do. Can't forget this. Probably a 10 pound difference of weight. At this particular day, there was four, and those body shots, as we get through five, six, seven, eight, and nine, may begin to take a toll. Hasn't been offensive minded yet. Power shots, 33 to 29. Those are being blocked. The judges don't count that. With the right hand. Here, when he throws the hook, Delahoya cuts off the ring and comes back. And this kid impresses me so much. He is a terrific coach because he doesn't want this guy to run. He wants to engage in a very good round for Mayweather. Oh, he really rocked Oscar coming in. Oscar, nice right hand. Good left hook. Face to this fight. This is a terrific. Now he tries it, goes to the body, back upstairs, chopping right hand. Cut him. Does it even up the round? Right back comes Floyd. Good, really interesting. 
Seesaw back and forth. Austin doesn't have the hand speed, but he has the power. Oh, he got thrilled to get beat to the punch right now. That's a Mayweather round. Here's a good example. That's a great shot right near the temple area. And takes one as he was trying to throw a left hook. Mayweather, he passes that test. So let's see now what happens. This fight is a series of shots to the body a couple of rounds ago to come forward, but he better be throwing. You know, he Floyd Mayweather. Nice uppercut. Oh. Mayweather has adjusted to De La Hoya coming in on him, and he's so now De La Hoya has to somehow get through without getting hit, and he should. Both of these guys for body shots at this stage. Sometimes <laughs> one head on right now. Uh, De La Hoya. Knockout, but that was right on top of the liver. Get away. He has to start getting off through his right hand, and so if De La Hoya misses it, Mayweather is long, lining up that right hand. Oscar De La Hoya got there. They're both in such magnificent shape. What be an accumulation of punches? And Oscar does have a tendency, folks, is very, very fast. Oscar's uh, admirably. I think he's winning this sixth round. And this is the morale. Coming back and loading up the right effort that we would expect from each guy. And the delivery. But Mayweather outboxing him now. As the bell ends the fight on. So if you're watching us, hello, everybody. Ahoya in red. Man colors. Red, white, and green. Tried to win some fans over by doing that. Here's Oscar. Caught him with the right hand. This is what Oscar has to do. Floyd just smiles at him. And he's doing a great job. Not interfering with the fight. But the round off. And let De La Hoya build the big. Look at him smiling. He loves it. Look at him. What a fighter is Mayweather. Got him the entire round. Uh, De La Hoya's round. And you know, maybe each guy will have to take one of these. Being a good seventh round. Jab, jab, is Floyd right? That's borderline by Floyd. Oscar goes downstairs. Look, I don't like that. I think it's dangerous for Floyd to get counter. Easy round for De La Hoya. Floyd was doing all the grinning and fooling around. He gave this round away. As the bell ends, rounds to go unofficially. De La Hoya by one point. Two different style fighters. The counter puncher with the speed. And that's what is going to decide this. So, yeah, De La Hoya may where the lands more. Look at this. Oscar on the assault. He fights has been averaging 50 punches around. And they will get him into that position. It will be a negative that he would have to over. Well, Oscar again is making the mistake of allowing him to come straight right hand. But, and, and that's possibly blocked. Those, those punches. And then try to go from there. Because to take a chance that you'll block. Round now. And remember, Oscar does have a history of getting tired. Now the chance go up for Oscar. Round. Floyd not doing enough now. Pretty. If Austin doesn't make the mistake, he makes, and he pays for it twice. I'll be satisfied when he's got him in his sights right in front of him. So, I mean, that's a minute point. Well, see, many other rounds in this fight, Tell Hoya Court. Close round, but I think Austin's won it. What do you think? I agree. Got the left hook. It's from earlier on to toward the end. The round, though. Uh, I gave him the round. I mean, he's, he's winning. The think Austin's got it. He's keeping the pressure on him. Austin will be back and forth. Remember, remember Larry Holmes, and you see his head go back. He's throwing when he's coming in. When he does, he scores. And asked hands of Mayweather being more accurate. They've been true to that script. Again, first over the last four to five rounds of this fight. A lot of them are being blocked. Oscar's trained well for this guy because he trained against him throwing a lot of punches. Even though a lot of them, you know, we talk him for real. His natural speed and quickness would allow him to take backing up, and he's not the one making the fight. And these intangibles, they start to weigh. Well, Oscar needed just this. Another one of these rounds. And in close rounds, while Mayweather continues to smile, this kid's a great athlete, though. See his left glove. Well, there's a lingering in the kill zone. See what happens? He's lingering in the kill zone. He gets hit. Hey, why give Floyd Mayweather a chance to get it back? Make it? Because he gets to the body. And this is the flurry he's been. I don't know. I think Taylor Hoyt's won this round, too. I think guy who's going for accuracy. Oscar's picking him off. Gordon. Mayweather's landed 136 punches compared to 99 for them hits. And remember, the way you judge a fight, effective again. The other element is that Mayweather's countering, and that's tough to... I think so. Puffiness by the right eye. Makes a mistake. Walsing into the kill zone without throwing any... It's hard. It's, that one gets through. Well, he still doesn't want to be straight in front of... Not to be right in front. He needs the angles if he's going to be in there. Now, remember, case for Oscars, we go through 10, 11, and 12. The jab out, right hand. See that every time. 
I see again, walked into the kill zone without throwing any fight. He was on him when he did that. Well, Floyd's winning this round. You're watching history. A throwback fight, no. This is this is a tremendously strategic but he will. And he does. His arms are slowed down considerably. I'll tell you this, it looks to me like Mayweather's got his second week. Scorecards. You, you want to have some momentum. momentum. Dave, you know what's happening? He can't reach him when his legs are far apart. And he's tired, too. That's, and that's a Mayweather. Landing. Good shots. Boom. Perfect big shot. Otherwise, I get a dead draw. With the proviso that four and eight were very phenomenal. Yeah. Good body shot by Floyd. I had mine mistakes. But cracked with the right hand. Perfect. Taylor made for counter punch with speed. Movement is more strategic. It's not defensive. And it's setting up his offense. And his heels are heavy. But he still has a heavy punch and of entering the kill zone without throwing any previous rounds of the fight. Again, not throwing coming in. With this, the right hand, he's found a spot for it. He's ducking down a hole. This is too close to call right now. The heavy of the thighs. He can't. And look at the foot movement here by Levin. Look very easy. Well, it's been a hit fight, if not arguably, the most popular fight in the world. There's the bell. How about the rounds? Nothing between the two. Who wants it the most? Who's in the best? Dave Bontempo, Oscar De La Hoya. Again, Floyd ties him up, counters him, nails at this. The battle is on. Oscar, he's throwing coming in. Floyd catches him as he turns away. Floyd is extraordinary with his hand speed. Now he just get, trying to do what he can, but wide shot for sure, and the other guy is so sharp. See him He's trying to concentrate with the body, lining up a Floyd Mayweather. There's Oscar making the mistake again. Have to look back. He hit a stamina wall. The man hit him with heavier blows, trying to load up a shot. He's giving it every. Did he rise to the occasion? Two tremendous athletes. De La Hoya pouring it on. Mayweather's been the better boxer and a good one. Will Floyd remain undefeated? Yeah, everyone thought he got hit, but he didn't. Sneaky right hand. Oh. What a fight! How about that? And they want to still go at it. Close rounds. Yes. Floyd Mayweather is a hard guy to like if you don't know him. Jerry Roth has